guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thank you for your support. So today I wanted to share with you a bit on my Fulti journey. So if you follow my channel, you'll see that I have started taking Fulti. I started prior and I had stopped and then I decided a few months ago that I was going to continue taking Fulti because I liked what it was doing for me. I've been taking Fulti for pretty much three months and a bit. I may have missed the occasional off day because either a hectic schedule or some emergency popped up. However, I made a concerted effort to every day take my Fulti as the bottle recommended. Now I have more than one bottle. I have two bottles, one that I keep in my kitchen in case I remember to take my Fulti in that location and one that I keep in my medicine cabinet in my bathroom. So of these bottles, this one is almost empty. Um, I probably have maybe 15 capsules left in this bottle. And so far, I believe I am enjoying some of the benefits of full tea. My energy level, I haven't noticed any spikes in my energy level. However, I noticed that when I comb my hair and part, I am not seeing the stark contrast of gray hair anymore also i remember showing you i had a temple gray hair along my hairline in this area i no longer see it and i can agree with my kids i don't see any grays here now i must say that i'm not taking full tea alone i have continued with my black strap molasses which i believe in and i don't know between the two of them which one has really made this difference but i do believe that my grays are no longer as visible i do have a gray that sprouts up here and this one is probably one of the most persistent and it is slightly copper colored but the contrast against the darkness of the other hairs is so visible that i prefer to keep it low and in my temple region along the front of my hairline here i no longer notice is that I have grays here anymore. So the hairs, the grays that I did have either have fallen out in the hair phase where it leaves or they have reverted to my original color, which was the intended aim of my N equals one experiment. So full tea or he shoo woo. Mind you, I am still taking my black strap molasses and I'm still using my knack and I do believe I have been seeing some of the benefits. One benefit that I noticed as a female is I, I believe my mammary tissues are becoming a bit firmer. <laughs> um, they feel firmer than before I was taking full tea. And I think that's a big positive for me. So I don't know who else out there is taking full tea and can either confirm or um, share your experience with full tea if you're a female. I would be very interested in knowing what experiences as a female you're having with full tea. So at this stage in my experiment, I am torn because I recently purchased a tincture of full tea, full tea extract. And this one is by, I don't know if you can see it there. Let me see if that helps. This is by Nature's Answer. And it says it has in 2000 milligrams of polygonum multiflorum. So I am contemplating utilizing the tincture in my cup of tea or my drink, probably nothing hot. Probably I will use it in something cool or cold, but I am contemplating switching from this Foti capsule that has 610 milligrams of polygonum multiflorum to this one that has 2000. Now, I have heard of other people using tinctures and tinctures are a lot more potent. So I might, instead of using it daily as was recommended by the makers of this one, Solar Ray, I might use this one as recommended on the label. However, because I am trying to be cautious 
with my liver i'll probably not use it on the weekend as i noted some other um youtubers have specified and they have specified and claim to experience benefits so if i do go this route i would be inclined to not use it daily so i don't know how many of you out there are using the tincture i would love to hear from you um, here of your experiences how you find it what you recommend is the capsule a better safer alternative to the tincture or is the tincture worth its amazing goal and i should go that route again i love to keep my videos short and sweet if you like this content and it's helpful to you please remember to hit that like button and smash the subscribe to become a part of my youtube family i look forward to hearing more from you and i look forward to making more content for you until next time remember love yourself and be good to yourself Goodbye.